All right, everybody. I have decided it's time to fight the weather. So, little weather head right here. Put it on display. I'll put a couple other trophies over here at some point. But I know I need at least three. So I think uh, I'm gonna go this way. It's near railroad station right here. For the town of Ardmore. Uh, did I fix that? Yeah. I had a reaper. Or a reaper. <laughs> uh, okay. I had a creeper sitting up on the roof. And uh, when I went up there to go finish the copper dome, it blew it up. So that was fun. Alright. So I'm thinking if we go up to the mob spawner. Mobby boys. Uh, did I not leave one at the side? I guess I didn't. Oh, well, I can go for a little run. I'll speed this stuff up and get you guys over to the, uh, where I'm going down. Actually, you know what? I don't need to speed anything up. I can go down right over here. Hey, oh. Right. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Um, no, I shouldn't go down the, that way. Those are the caves. I want to go down to my strip mines. It's got a nice low ceiling for most of it, I'd say. Going down to a new Almost there. I can see the bottom. Alright. And... We're down. Okay, so these are all the ones that I want on up widening, but these look like, yes, too tall, this, and this is a little chamber over here, okay, um, oh, oh, maybe, maybe, these are all threes, twos and a chamber, okay, oh, perfect, so if I trap him right down, Am I gonna have to? I think I'm gonna have to carve something new out. I've expanded all these looking for diamonds. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, oh. Yep. Here we go. Okay. Um, we will go with right in here. Oh, hey. What? I forgot diamonds. How do I forget diamonds down here? They were just tucked right off to the side. Sweet. And like any good diamond miner, I'm going to go ahead and see if there's any around here. Nope. I do not want to make this any more than uh, three tall, though. I want him to get trapped. Uh, do I want him to get trapped? I'm going to make iron golems. The iron golems have to be three tall. So maybe... Maybe I go back to that other chamber. Yeah, let's do that. Alright. Here we go. Okay. So, now that I sped forward because I, I just was being a bit indecisive with uh, taking care of stuff, I'm going to go um, expand this chamber out just a little bit. So we know that we need these iron golems in there. And bam. Alright, go cool, cool, grab all that stuff. And I need my pumpkin heads. I need my soul sand. Uh, oh, wait, and soul sand. We'll get these off first. Alright. Uh, one, two, three, four. And five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Uno, dos, tres. Oh. What? I thought I had enough iron. Uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, yeah, nope. I was going by multiples of three and not by multiples of four. So we're going to one and two, and we're going to make do with just these guys. Oh, 
Come on. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to take this and this out of my inventory. Pop that, take that into my inventory. I'm well fed. Okay. Alright, you guys. Here we go. Oh boy. I didn't mean to hit him. Where the fuck is he going? Oh boy! Was not expecting that. My palms are sweating. Oh boy! What's going on? Why is he all blue like that? Oh shit! Charge again. Run. Get over here. Get away from that fucking lava. Motherfucker. Did I get him? Fucking guys, I got him! I need torches. It's so dark down here. It is so dark down here. He's gonna blow up. I did it! I finally beat the wither for the first time. Oh, man. Oh man, that's awesome. I can finally make a peek at it. Guys, I'm stoked. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm stoked. My heart is racing, my palms are sweaty, but I killed the wither, and I've got another star. And he gave me some stuff. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab all this material, shove it in my shoulder. Uh, nice. Alright, well, I'm gonna. Calm myself down just a little bit. <laughs> Whew. Shake. While I'm at this video, I figure I'll show you guys my progress on all this stuff. Since I did mention last week that I was gonna work on villagers. So, I got these villagers here. Still don't have mending yet. I, uh, I've broken a few of the pedestals, but each time... I wind up with stuff that I actually want. Not this guy. I think I might kill Julian. This guy over here, he will not turn into a librarian, no matter how many times I give him a pedestal. He's got to be too close to other stuff. But I'll eventually get one of them over the river, over there, somewhere, over on that side of the river, get him away from the city. I'm a little bunny rabbit. So over here is my new iron farm. That's right, I finally did it. I made an iron farm. I gotta work on making the rates more consistent. It takes a second while I've been here for him to start jumping in. I usually just uh, AFK an account right there. and In about an hour I'll get two, maybe three hundred iron. Come on. I swear. I promise this works. Once it gets moving, it actually starts moving. 
maybe some of you might have a little tip of what I could do to get this thing moving a little bit sooner or a little bit more frequent. Hmm. Maybe they don't like my beef. They think I've got beef. Maybe buckets? The iron golems like buckets? Hello, iron golems. Hello. Anybody? I just... I just want a little bit of iron. Come on. <laughs> Oh, of course, as soon as I get out of here. Here he goes. Burn, baby, burn. See, there's some iron in the chest. A little bit iron. Easy, there's another. See, I told you. Once it gets no one, it actually gets cut. I'm not going to hang around here. Dealing with that. Uh, well, you know, maybe I do go downstairs and at least explain that to you. So, for those of you who haven't made an iron generator, I'm still, you know, versing myself in all the technicalities of it, but you need 20 beds. So I have 10 over here, and I have 10 over here, and you want to separate them from the villagers just underneath, so the villagers connect and disconnect to the beds, so they never actually have a sleep cycle in each time goes through a whole cycle, iron golems keep, uh, will, will have a chance to appear, not necessarily appear, but I think it was a 1 in 70 chance. And then I have 20 villagers, each one, I like the barrels, just because, well, they're cheap, very cheap. Uh, might as well show you the little balcony, just, just cause, just cause, what's so peaceful. Such a nice Minecraft world. Lonely little bamboo. Oh. Little glowy, little glowy mushroom over there. That's at the end of the other rail entrance. So you all know by now that I, I love my railroads. I've got the railroad that goes there, into Ardmar, well, new Ardmar. Over on the other side, I have the old Ardmar Railroad, which... I have in other videos. Then I have that big, deep, under-ocean one. It takes about eight minutes to get across. Another iron golem. <laughs> uh, I, I just, I can't express how excited I am that this is now working, because that item sorter, well, it's, it's taken on a new wing. So, with, let's go just take a look at that real quick, okay? Hold on one second. Here we go. I, by the way, I've been putting blocks here uh, just because the villagers like to come in. And then they try and claim my bed. And it's my bed. I've got the nice sheets on it. i got the nice pillow. These little guys sweat all the time. And it just, it stinks. It stinks. I mean, you see this? You see those wrinkles? One of them got into my bed. What the heck, man? Leave my bed alone. <laughs> By the way, last time I didn't show this off to you. I, I can't believe I didn't show this to you. This is the sign for my item sorter. Ass load, or as load. Auto storage load optimizer and declutterer. Because I have an as load of stuff. Get it? Alright, so this, this past week I reorganized the whole item sorter. We have all sorts of stone... Uh, apparently Jamie's car payment's tomorrow. Uh, did not turn my notifications off. I'm gonna hang my head in shame. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Okay. Anyway. Stone blocks. Stone blocks categorized by type, by breakdown. More stone blocks. Then we come down here and we have all of the wood blocks I just don't have doors or gates in here because those well gates I make so few of and doors well they're gonna have their own little section but for right now they stay in another chest and then a little filler over here uh, using up the rest of some stones Got my 
red netherrack, which I love. Netherrack, we have a brick, all little bricky bricks. And then down here, this floor, I decided I needed to start doubling up some of the bigger stuff. So, like, sugarcane and paper. We got buttloads and buttloads of cobble. As you can see, I was digging in the middle of that. But I got all sorts of breakdowns of big bulk items down here now including my trees and I got you know, books, picture frames, all sorts of terracotta and stuff like, not the upper one yet, but I'll get there. Now that I have the storage I'm gonna actually just go on big farming ventures and start filling all this stuff up you know, blaze rods and stuff. I get my blaze spawner so that should fill up pretty quick and yeah Yep, there's the item sorter, and I wanted to show you this week as well. I kind of did like a brief highlight last time, but you see this little setup right here. I've had a lot of questions about, well, how does it work? Well, I'm going to show you. So this is your this is your base floor setup right here. So we have one block in the back, space block space space block and then put another one here this is going to be your T you actually are going to need one more block here in the front as I'm putting this in I'm like oh yeah I need this too <laughs> okay so we've got two chests up front on top of those two blocks with a hopper attached to the back and then we have these right here so this is going to be our redstone torch this is going to be our repeter, the redstone repeter, and make that T once you have these two items in place, and then over here, your comparator faces towards this setup, and crouch down, add a little hopper to the front of that, you're connecting it to the front of this comparator. Uh, but redstone dust, redstone dust, redstone dust. Forty-four items in the hopper right here. And it goes one, two, three, four. And since we have plenty of redstone dust, we'll go ahead and put some redstone dust right there. We're gonna have a chest, and we're gonna have a hopper connect to that chest. Proceeding hoppers go here, like that, and then I put these in here, and while we're at it we throw these in there, then you'll see those chests went over there, but those redstone dust went right there, and see how those little red dots are on? That means that this is loaded up. So you have 45 items in here, 44 of which are your generic item. Like I said, I usually use cobblestone slabs because I don't use cobblestone slabs in my builds often. So it's easy enough for me to just not put that in an item sorter slot until I hit, what, I think there's 836 or something. There's over 800 unique items in Minecraft. So the last one, when I eventually have all of them in my item sorters, will be the cobblestone, uh, cobblestone slab. But yeah, this is just a, a standard, pretty simple item sorter setup. And that, my friends, is the end of this week's episode. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I, I hope that the live content was enjoyable too. I don't know if I'm nearly as animated when I'm trying to record my audio after the fact, at least this way you get to kind of hear me as I'm experiencing things. And that wither, oh my goodness, I am so excited. I'm going to work on that beacon. I'm going to get this stuff all figured out. And next week, we're going to have a beacon in the base. And I'm going to try and go with one that's uh, increasing my, my speed. I'm going to go with the haste one. Yeah, haste. I like speed. Uh, not that speed. Not, not that speed. Maybe maybe some pot, but not speed. No. Well, maybe. Bye! <laughs>